Hello Hitman fans! In this video we follow two mission stories, Last Honors and Winds of Change. At the end we ignore the constant. We exit via the rooftop by summoning a helicopter using a flare. Are you with me? Let's go! From the harbor we go to the security room near the castle entrance. Shoot the security system and skedaddle. We activate the mission story Last Honors. We're going to the warehouse near the helipad to find a dagger. Follow me. We boldly enter the helipad area, but we stay crouched and hidden behind the crates. We have arrived at the warehouse. Hug the wall. We shall infiltrate through a window. Turn on this radio. We'll attract a custodian disguise. Hey, somebody trying to be funny here or what? Let him turn off the radio before choking him. Pull him a bit to make sure he is well hidden. Take his uniform. Now we go get a crowbar. Let's start opening crates. The dagger is in the other room, but I want to open all 9 crates to complete the Raider of the Lost Ark challenge. Be careful, there is an enforcer in the room with the dagger. No. 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 Bingo! Dagger found. I'll open three more crates to complete the Raider of the Lost Ark challenge. We have the dagger. Time to go to the morgue and take Janice's burial robes. The council's still in session? No, they've called a recess. Sophia Washington wants them to pass some kind of motion. Watch out, there is a guard patrolling the area and he will see you breaking in. Inside the morgue, there are three raiders and a mortician. We'll distract all of them and subdue most of them before taking the burial robes. 
This is going to be fun. Turn on the boiler, that will make one of the raiders come to it. Now wait here for a while. Tamper with the fuse box to make another raider come. In the meantime, we take care of the first one. Close the door. Turn off the boiler. Now let's take care of the second raider before he rectifies the fuse box issue. Take his gun and drag him inside, near his buddy. Close the door. Now we wait for the next victim. Drag her inside and place her near the others. Close the door. The last raider is going to investigate the fuse box, but we won't need to subdue him. The burial robes at last. Let's try them on. Now we go to the harpist and tell her to start performing. Then we go in the coffin and play dead for a couple of minutes. We're all set. Cue the music. You, playing dead? Hmm, this takes me back. Good thinking, 47. Sophia taking over, fought us tooth and nail, but a fat lot of good it did you. The partners, they turned a deaf ear, and deep down, Janus, you know why. Because, for all your smarts, you're just rank and file. Pedestrian, middle class, blah. And we have the one thing Merit can't buy. Blue. Blood. 
That's right. Good old fashioned pedigree. That is why Sophia and me will one day be partners of Providence, and you'll spend eternity as a wax figure. So long, mastermind. <laughs> One target down. Nice work, 47. Next up, Sophia Washington. Let's dispose of the body. The ocean is near. Now we go back to the morgue. Be careful around this guard. We go up the stairs all the way to the top. Perfect. Our next disguise is waiting for us. Pick up the gun and drag his body inside. Then take his clothes. Now we start the second mission story of this tutorial, Winds of Change. Let's go towards the marker. Take this emetic. We'll use it to make Jebediah Block sick and take his clothes. I'm going to make a little detour here and acquire the flare needed to exit via the rooftop. Here it is, in the room below Jebediah Block. Now let's go poison Mr. Block's drink. In order to poison Jebediah Block's drink, we have to make sure no one is looking at us while doing so. We distract the guard that is near while keeping an eye on the guard who is further away patrolling. A faster way of getting to Block would be to subdue all three guards. However, the Constant is on his way to talk to Block, and I don't think I have the time to subdue four NPCs before he arrives. Drag his body to make sure no one finds him. Take his costume. Now let's go talk to Sophia Washington. The marker tells us where she is. So, brain uploads, huh? Living forever as a string of code. Our parents were afraid of the missiles, but I think we both know that... I don't feel like running towards her. I'll just wait here and eventually she will come. Miss Washington, after due consideration, I have revised my position. I would like to support your motion. Well, well, look at you, Block. 
finding your good sense and manners. Come along then. After talking to Sofia, there is no need to walk with her. Just follow me, I'll show you where the voting room is. Sit down and wait. Sophia will be here in a minute. Go and tell Sophia if you're ready to vote. The night's not getting any younger. Well, you've certainly placed yourself at the crossroads of history. Nicely done, 47. Let's reiterate. So, everyone in favor, say aye. 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 Yay or nay, Block. Silence is consent. To kill her with the Iron Maiden, vote against. Nay. Excuse me? You heard me. Nay. Oh, for the love of... Ah, oh, idiot. Son of a... Blocked. You stupid... Oh. That's... Four eyes and one nay. Jebediah Block vetoes the motion. This council is adjourned until further notice. Flock. A word? Upstairs. Right away, please. Okay, let's go upstairs to be yelled at by Sophia. Sit down. Or not, it doesn't matter. Are you gonna tell me what the hell you're playing at? Just looking out for number one. Don't be an idiot. There's no future in coal, Block. You have one choice. Go green or go extinct. Now, personally, I don't give a shit if you go the way of the Dodo, but you are one of the Ark Society's biggest contributors. We'd hate to lose your business. Besides, if terrestrial coal goes under, who will pay for your children's survival? Your grandkids. After all, nobody says disaster will strike in our lifetime. You have a moral duty to stay rich, Block. Nice try, but I don't have grandchildren. You just had to make this difficult, didn't you? Here's the deal, Block. My family and I... We serve a group of powerful individuals who prefer to stay anonymous. Letting the climate go to hell in a handbasket has served their interests well, but only up to a point. You see, they are sitting on some patents that'll knock your socks off. Weather control systems, recycling pollution as fuel, cold fusion, you name it. And they plan to make trillions protecting the world from the very threat they worked so hard to create. But to do so, they need you guys to quite literally stop fighting windmills. Huh. The truth at last. And what's in it for Jebediah Block? Gentlemen, please give me and Mr. Block a moment. I offered you a carrot. Now, here's the stick. We know about Montana, Block. The mine collapse in 2015. It would be a shame if the American public got wind of your somewhat creative approach to safety regulations. Your popularity ratings are just south of John Wilkes Booth as it is. No! Both targets down. Impressive work, 47. Follow me to the rooftop exit. If you don't have the flare with you, the exit icon will have a little lock, signaling you can't access it. helicopter, but the place is crawling with security. 47, you better bring the constant to the harbor where it's less crowded. 
You can hijack one of the Archean boats. Question is how? He's not likely to come quietly. Unless you get your hands on a kill switch. Yes, that might just work. Search so one of the twins, 47. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, even though it was a bit long. I say goodbye, and until next time, don't forget to have fun!